hi guys welcome back to my channel um i wanted to do a little tuesday morning haul and then i also have a scrapbook.com order and then a couple well just one amazon item so let's get to it i found these oh my god everything's falling on me okay i found these uh, style board crepe paper cards. I thought they were super cute. I love the uh, prints. So I picked these up. They were $5.99. Kind of expensive for cards, but well, you know. So got those. Um, I also found these Paper Love um, treat bags. Say popcorn on them. I'm going to do my son's birthdays coming up in August, and I wanted to do a carnival theme, so I thought this was super cute. Pick that up. I also got these little favor boxes. So look at how cute that is. Oh, my God. I'm hoping Tuesday morning carries these rosettes. Oh, my God. That would be awesome. So I got that. Um, also got this. Um, paper punch from EK Tools. I saw a couple ladies pick it up, including my sister, and I was like, damn, I should have picked it up, but my Tuesday morning had it, so I was like, yay! Pick that guy up, and okay. I was so excited to find these, the Good Vibes Ephemera Packs. Oh my god. I found the Good Vibes 6x6, the puffy stickers, and I also found the paper pack, but I never found the ephemera. And I was like, yay! I made the lady, um, well, my Tuesday morning still didn't have their crafting stuff out, um, but my store is nice and they let me look through the card before they take it out. So I was like, yay, first dib. So got two of those. I also got, so a lot of um, my mind's eye is showing up. I picked up this paper pad, Wander. Um, I don't do a whole lot of traveling, but I thought it was really cute for like a guy's, you know, like Father's Day card. So it has really cute, let me see if I could show you. It has really cute, um, look at that. Isn't that so cute? Really cute prints that you can definitely use for a Father's Day card or a birthday card for a guy. And I believe they're double sided. Yes, they are. Oh my god, I love this one. So cute. Okay, so, and they also had the ephemera packs for them. So I picked up two. Look at that little moped. Love the motor home. Look at it. That is so old school. Who remembers that? <laughs> Got those. And I picked up another one of the Imagine paper pads. Kind of pricey, but since I didn't find a lot this time at Tuesday morning, I was like, okay, I'm gonna pick another one up. This is when, so that way I wouldn't go over my budget. Okay, and Splendor Collection is showing up at Tuesday morning, guys. Look at these, I bought them there. See, $2.99. Oh my goodness, I was super excited. Look at that. Oh my god, this is so Maggie Home ish inspired. Like these florals. It's just so pretty and they're double sided, of course. Look at that. Yep. So I picked up two of those. Super excited about that. Okay, so um for my For my scrapbook.com order, I ordered a couple items that I needed. Um, let me let me grab that die so I could show it to you. Okay. 
right so i ordered this guy i needed the the long plate and it was kind of funny because i ordered it and i thought it came in pairs and then when i got here i was like crap there's only one i was like Ugh. so then i emailed scrapbook.com and i was like you know i'd like to return it because i thought it was a pair and oh it was 11 dollars on amazon it was 18 dollars a pair so i was like I'm just going to um, return it and order from Amazon. And then, oh my God, they sent me an email back and they were like, oh no, don't worry, Cynthia, you know, I'm sorry you misread that. And we're going to ship you one free of cost. I was like, what? So I just got the other one today. I thought that was super nice. I was like, wow, scrapbook.com, customer service is bomb.com. So I have my two plates now. So I ordered that and okay so this is what I was like kind of punching myself in the face for I had just ordered that splendor collection from scrapbook.com and then all of a sudden like a couple days later I'm like oh I found it at Tuesday morning so I was like that's okay I mean I'm totally gonna use this stuff so it doesn't matter so I got this guy and then I got the ephemera packs which I was looking for I was like oh my god what if um Tuesday morning has the ephemera pack sorry guys the glare is bad okay there look at how beautiful these are so I got two of those and then I also got the stickers. Let's see, there we go. Look at that cluster. Oh my god. You know, I love that these roses are real and then they have like like they look real, you know, like if they took the picture out of a real flower. I don't know. I just love that. And I got two of the chipboards. There. Love this one. So I got that. I also got the Good Vibes um paper pad because I didn't find it at Tuesday morning, and I did find the ephemera and the chipboard at Tuesday morning. So I was like, I'm just gonna pick it up. That way I could have the full collection. Oh my god, look at that. Oh, yes. Yep, so I got this one. I wonder, if, no, it's not double sided. Okay. And I also picked up the Splendor um, paper pack. So super excited. Look at it, comes with the. Oh my god, I love this color. So it comes with a pack of stickers. So that is my scrapbook.com order. I also did order the Sunny Days collection, but I want to do a separate video for that one and show you guys that in another video. So I also, Amazon, I have two items. So I ordered those plates for this guy. I'm super excited to use this. I saw Bona and everybody using this and I'm like, oh, I need it in my life. So I ordered this one. I got this one a couple weeks ago, so that's why it's already ready and prepped to store and then I got this my husband bought it for me for my birthday I got the brother scanning cut sorry guys the box is humongous but um, I'm super excited I've been wanting this forever and I was so indecisive about the crib cut or whether I should get this one. I was like, God, which one do I get? Which one do I get? But then my sister has a Cricut cut. So I was like, you know, I'll just use her Cricut cut for whatever I want. And she can use my brother's scanning cut for whatever she wants. So um, I was like, I'll just keep the, the brother's scanning cut. Because I, I, I had gotten it and I was like, I'm going to switch it for the cameo. But then I was like, mm, no, I looked up reviews and stuff. And... The cameo doesn't really cut out a whole lot, which I will tell you that the Cricut was the top that cut best from all three machines. But I was like, mm, I really like the British scanning cut. 
So I'm just gonna keep it. It comes with these little markers. And also it has the cutting mat, which I'm gonna have to order more of. And yeah, so I've been dying to open this guy. I'm gonna do an unboxing. Okay, so I need to like move everything on my desk in my corners now because I need to find space for it. Every time I do that, do you guys do that? You buy one thing or like eight paper pads and you're like whole new rearrangement of um, organization and moving your stuff in your craft room. We're crazy. Well, I'm crazy like that. Um, yeah, so I'm like dying to open this because you guys, I am going to stick these on paper on cardstock and I am gonna cut all of this out to use as ephemera that was like as soon as I saw it I was like oh my god brother scan and cut cut it and I know it's funny huh I bought the book before I even had the brother scan and cut <laughs> but I knew that that was on my goal list so I was like I'm gonna get it eventually I'm gonna get it so I'll come back to show you guys while I'm cutting these guys out but I'm so excited Alright guys, thanks for watching.